Hello. Can boss it. Aye. Talk back, the slay needed. It's not safe. He got thrown overboard for his trouble. They're not all psychos, though. What are you gonna do now? Get the fuck out of here, that's what. I'll get my gear together, then go find that treasure. And after that, it's goodbye, Antigua, and thanks for fuck all. Watch out, world. Whatever you've got, I'm coming to get it. Too late, I already stole it. Anyway. So, there is a corrupted file in the last video, so several minutes of it were missing. Basically, we did everything we need to do, and now it's time to talk to Slank again. At least I think we did everything. We got the powder, the helmsman, and the fish. One more thing. Fire away, sport. How many barrels of fish do you need? A couple will do. I can get them from Eddie the Fisherman. <laughs> well, make sure you get the best stuff. I like a nice piece of mullet or snapper. Oh, man, I feel back to talking to that guy. Things just aren't what they used to be. I'll drink to that. This blacksmith still is not showing up. Thing is, I think he's somewhere. Because I can't use this forge, which means he's probably trying to use it. But he must be stuck somewhere. Anyway, let's not worry about that now. <laughs> yeah. Who the hell is this? Just a word of warning, like. There's seven shades of shit out there in the world. No buggers coming to help you if you land up in the clag. Least of all me, right? I've been in the wild. Well then, count yourself lucky you didn't end up some monster's lunch. Take my advice. Next time you fancy a stroll, go to Blood Oath Square. Blood Oath Square? I've never heard of it. It's where the captain's house is, mate. You know, where they used to initiate pirate captains into the Creed? Yeah. And punish them who broke the Creed, too. Used to be, if you broke the Creed, they'd sort you out permanent. All overgrown now, the square is. Full of bleeding winos, too. You know your way around Antigua? Born and bred, mate. Born and bred. Of course, it ain't like it was when I was a nipper. Never used to get all these shitting monsters coming ashore for stars. The monsters must be Mara's creatures. My job's making bloody sure none of these shitters gets into town. Just think, I used to have an easy life. Tell me about the backwoods. Straight ahead, a little further on, there's the spring where the water carriers work. There's fishing on the east beach. Old Mac, he's on the west beach. He keeps watch for ships. There's caves too. Loads of plants and animals. You're on some bleeding nature ramble. I see. Don't you ever get bored? Not me, mate. I get to sit out here all day, soaking up this lovely sun. So long as there ain't no monsters about, there's nothing better. Settling down with a beautiful woman? All oh, sounds a bit too much like old work to me, mate. Nah. I'm glad the Admiral assigned me this number. A spot of sunshine, top of rum, not much action. Easy life. 
Why are these creatures coming here? I've heard it's because the old island's cursed. Word is, a bunch of pirate captains woke some shitting supernatural entity from her sleep. Let me tell you, I've seen some bloody horrible creatures lately. Nasty bastards. It'll kill you soon as look at you. It's like they hate people. Like we're their enemies. Creepy, innit? I heard you've got a thing for Grace. Yeah? And? What bloke round here doesn't? <laughs> Men. What's it to you, anyhow? Never mind. Doesn't matter. Maybe not a good idea. Can you show me how to fight? If you've got any gold, sure. I have time to fight the swordsman. Show me how to fight. What do you want to know? Show me how to counter parry. Your basic parry blocks off your opponent, all right? But it don't give you the initiative. So don't just use your blade just to stop the other guy's attack. Use it to knock his weapon aside instead. Pick your moment, and then you can even block off a whole series of attacks. Let me see how much money I have. Not much. Show me how to. F Would you? What do I want to know? I want to make advanced attacks. An advanced attack needs more than just muscle. You need to use speed. You need your whole body tensed, ready to explode into action in an instant. Then put everything you've got into the swing. How can I improve my saber skills fast? It's all in the wrist, mate. It needs to be more stable. The force comes from your arm. <laughs> So grip the saber more firmly when you strike. You want arm, wrist, and saber working as one. You got me. Cool. What's my thing here? Very fine. So I need like 50. Shit. Do I have any potions on them? Probably. I'll bet you don't miss a trick, do you? You're not wrong, mate. I've got eagle eyes, me. No one gets past me unnoticed. Oh, well. Nice. Over here. Time to get up. What's that? Yeah. The stocks. Fuck.
How does a counter work? Is that like automatic? What the hell is this? Hey, you, Wanka. Got a bottle of rum for your old pal, Myers? Here, have a rum. Ah, you're a good pal. So what do I get in return? The eternal attitude. I mean, gratitude. Great. Shouldn't you be working instead of drinking? Why? No work to do. So might as well meet up with me old pal, Paul and Grog. You met my friend Kiko Ass? Aye, no need to turn nasty. What do you want, anyway? Got some barrels of water for me? No can do, buddy. No water for anyone. Uh, Rockin' pig. No need to be so bloody judgmental, eh? What? what? As long as Butch is pissing us off, none of us water carriers are doing anything. Water? What the fuck do you want to drink that stuff for anyways? Go see Spencer in the tavern. He'll give you something good. This looks like a shit job. Why do it? Well, that's complicated. <laughs> Don't tell anyone. But I sometimes drink a bit too much. You don't say. I do no, think Twitch said. Back then, I was with the Admiral's crew. Bit of a stick while the old Admiral didn't take to drinking on duty. So he chucked me off the crew. <laughs> Bastard. I see. How can I convince you to deliver water anyway? You can't! Not with that bastard butch around. He's enforcing the em... Um, 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 the trade ban. No water while he's sticking to the rules. Tough one, is he? Fancy your chances against him, do you? Was supposed to get water? I don't remember that. What? Haven't you got anything better to do than bug me? Hey, I don't need to be hostile. I'm not being hostile. What is it you want? What is it you do here, exactly? What does it look like? I checked those idiots over there don't slack on the job. They're not working? As long as the Admiral's orders stand, we're on a break. I need the water barrels. I can't do that until the Admiral gives the order. Not even for you, Captain. If you're going to be a real pirate, you should do something pirate-like. Like what? Like be master and commander of your own ship. I hate ships. And water. And being in the water when ships sink. 
Become a feared master swordsman? All that poncy sword waving, not a chance. No one will fight me anymore anyway. Maybe get a talking parrot? Flea-ridden shoulder shitters? No thanks. Get a peg leg and say you got it in battle. Hacking off my old leg doesn't much appeal. Oh my god, dude. Get my thief skill up. Whatever, let's just go talk to the fisherman guy. Oh shit, it's blue cloth.
Monkey! I'm so glad that hobgoblin didn't get you, mate. Me too. Well, it wasn't a hobgoblin, it was a leviathan. And that's gonna make me feel better. At least we're both still alive, thanks to that hero. Sorry I ran off and left you for that thing, mate. Oh, well, I wasn't gonna mention that, but now that you have... Still mates, eh? Takes more than some sea monster to change that. That's nice. It's a shitty world, isn't it? Just glad there's still brave blokes like you in it. That bastard Eddie. If I die, I bet he'll want to give my girl some special comforting. Oh, yeah. Didn't he he sees again every here. year. You notice that? That was a waste of time. How do I get Butch out of the way? Have you tried bribing him? The piss poor pirate who wasn't up for a bit of buggery, I mean bribery. Or maybe you can just lure him into the little cave or beast. That's an idea. I'm still gonna have to fight him though. It's that way sometimes. Less you can do do voodoo. Uh, How's that gonna help me? The Malakas can you know, <coughs> take over people's minds and such. <laughs> but you'd make a great puppet, don't you think? I'd love to see that. You know, for a drunken, rum stinking shit pit of a human being. Or I could just give him a sock in the mouth. Cock in his mouth? Oh, that's not. Oh, I, I get you. Glad to hear it. <laughs> Cock in his mouth. That's a good one. If you're going to be a real pirate, you should do something pirate like. Like what? I hear there's a cave full of treasure somewhere nearby. I'd like to see that on a map. X marks somewhere nearby. Great. That treasure cave must be quite close by. So you say. It's too big a hoard to dig up alone. We can split it if you want to help. Mm, well, you are quite puny, so you will need help. Tell me. Exactly where is this supposed treasure, then? There's a small cave on the mountain opposite the watering hole. You're sure? Of course. It's at the very back. Mm. I suppose I could take a look. You should. No chance. You're coming with me. And you better not be spouting bullshit. Fine. You go first. Move it, you... Now pick him in here and pick his ass, I guess. What? So, now it's just the two of us. You set me up, you sneaky little shit! Maybe not a good oh, idea. Oh damn, I can't do that. So you're not a total idiot after all. 
You'll be sorry you started this. Don't dance, fight. Ah! You can take the water barrels to the quayside now. Butch won't give you any trouble. He won't? We'll get you, your daughter. I mean, water, then. Nice. What the hell is she doing when we're back here? Check out this warehouse some more. Uh. I thought I had a key or something for this place. Think he's been up the crow's nest with her yet? Thank you. 
Alrighty. I'm not entirely sure how much time it's been, so let me check. Alright, we're safe. <laughs> Need to figure out how that common area works. One more thing. Fire away, sport. Fresh water's on its way. Nice one, Sport. That was my biggest worry. Get stuck at sea without water, you'll end up drinking your own piss. And that's just no fun at all. Let's get out of here soon. Is that not everything? Oh, a cannon. Where the fuck do I get a cannon? What do you have? <sighs> Where the hell am I gonna get a cannon? Teach me. What are you? Mm. Why not? Not without. St not without steel being to lead him. Seriously. And he was the best of them all. I get the distinct feeling that William is well, the type of person who can give me a cannon. Or Wilson, sorry. But what do you he mean? is nowhere. He should be here or he should be inside. But either he's invisible or he's bugged. I haven't seen him anywhere. See, right now I can't use his bed, which means he's trying to use it, which means he's stuck somewhere. Hmm, here's something. The harbor master told his story to everyone who passed by about how a gnome had stolen his flask while he slept. As he was the only one who saw the gnome, however, he was laughed at by all. So, gnomes.
So I'm going to see, right after this, I'm going to see if there's a bug involved with Wilson. And if it can be fixed. Alright, so he seems to be locked in Henry's house. I can try and talk to him through the window, though. That looks like a lot of work. That it is, lad. Is it something important you're after? Only if it isn't, piss off out of it. I'm busy. How the hell is he stuck here? You lost a pistol, Wilson? How'd you know about that? I know where it is now. Well then, where? That old pistol means a lot to me. Speak up, or I'll loosen your tongue with me branding iron. You must have really pissed on me off. That asshole. He says I owe him gold. Well, do you? Depends how you look at it. I gave him my pistol to repair. Only he won't give it back until I paid him what he says I owe. I'll get your pistol back. Henri won't just stand it over. Especially not if all you're gonna do is give it back to me. Here's your pistol, back from the gunsmiths. My lovely piece. I got you back at last. I won't let you out of my sight ever again, my beauty. Thank you, lad. Truly, I'm in your debt. Nice cannons you've got here. Aye, and hands off. I'm selling nothing. Not till the trade embargo's lifted. Couldn't you make an exception? I ain't breaking the Admiral's embargo for you, lad. Why the fuck do you think I'd do that? You're the new captain, ain't you? News travels fast round here. Everyone knows everyone on Antigua. It's how we've kept ourselves hidden away from the Inquisition for so long. News gets around as far as strangers are concerned. You so much as fart in a bathtub. Trust me, I'll hear about it. You won't last two minutes. That's what everyone thinks. Because I'm too young to be a captain? No, because you're the jumped up little no mark who gets up people's noses. No offense. I helped you, now it's your turn. Sounds fair enough to me, lad. What is it you want? I need cannons. In that case, I'll send some down to the quayside, so you can choose exactly the ones you want. You breathe one word of this to the Admiral, mind. My lips are sealed. You make sure they stay that way. Don't worry, it'll be our little secret. Good. What do you sell? What does it look like, lad? Woo! Maybe not. Fuck, that was a bad idea. Little bird. What? Who said so? Is it true? Since you ask, I'm not without affection for the lady in question. That plus you want to jump her bones, right? What if I could fix you up with Grace? Me? With Grace? <laughs> Fat chance. Why? Do you think you really could? Trust me, I've got a way with ladies. Maybe you do, maybe you don't, lad. But all she sees in me is a fat old labourer with lice in my beard. So good luck with that. We'll see. Fine. If you think you can talk her into it. But I won't be nobody's fool, lad. Alright. Shouldn't have brought that, but whatever. Let's see if I can do this. Bust them out or something. 
I need the right key here. I'd like to know why there's no mention of why he's locked up in there. Listen, about that Smith, Wilson. That penniless oaf, what's he got to do with you? He sent you here, didn't he? Typical. He sent you here to beg on his behalf, didn't he? How pathetic. What are you, a pirate or an errand boy? He'll pay you. For your time and inconvenience, of course. Talk to me like that again, and I'll have a word with my good friend, the Admiral. Someone like you can't afford to be so choosy. You better scram sharpish, mate, before I do something I regret. Well, I fucked that up. Let's try again. Do we need, like, silver tongue or something? I don't know. something that will hurt. How dare you, sir? I'm a lady. Fallen on hard times and need to make extra cash. How ungentlemanly. I thought we could help each other here. Yes. There's a name for men who use women the way you want to use me. If you had a word with him and explained things to him... Well, perhaps. But it'll cost you. One thousand gold, and I'll be willing to forget this slur on my honor. A thousand? Just for... Yes? You were going to add some ungallant and impertinent remark? Me? Never. I'll no, worry about that later. I don't have a thousand gold to spare right now. Come with me. I'm certainly no blacksmith. Oh, why I bought that? So I need to learn blacksmithing just to make it. Oh well. What in the name of the pox is going on here? Something the matter, Admiral? Don't pretend you don't know, you scrofulous stroat. I've made it plain. All trade is strictly forbidden. That should be clear enough even to one as bollock-brained as you. Remind him of the creed. Listen, Admiral, your dispute's with Slain, not me. I don't care. No cargo leaves my harbor, and that's the end of it. Those things are mine now, Alvarez. I made a deal with each of your people. And like it says in the Creed, a deal's a deal. Isn't that right? You presume to turn the words of the Creed against me? You conniving ball bag! Slain has put you up to this! Go, then. I cannot go against the Creed. But remember this, Captain. If we fight each other, Mara has won. Mark my words, and beware of her henchmen! Alright, he's pissed off. Alright, seeing as we don't have too much time left, uh, we'll cast off in the very next episode. See you guys.